man. Fresh off a nigga getting his ass whooped. We back, baby. Man, hey, Haney. Man. Nigga, come up here with us, nigga. Or go, go fill you a motherfucking Amazon application now. Bro, it's like every time they show their daddy, that nigga Garcia started whooping his ass even more. <laughs> You saw his daddy was doing the interview sad and he knocked his ass out, sad Reggie. Sad sight. Sad sight. We got Reggie Ball in the motherfucking yes, sir. building, We man. back, baby. We back. Reggie. We back. We back. Yes, sir. The one and only. FMB, we got my boy man in this motherfucker. You know the vibe. You know the vibe. You know Welcome the vibes. back, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, bro, sir. Bro, Manny. Yes. Now, I don't know, bro. I don't know what it is, but I love when you motherfucking win, bro. And you know why? Cause you get on there and you pop oh, your shit. shit. When that nigga say another FMB exclusive, <laughs> top two, not number two, go. You when know that nigga right. do that shit. I said, yeah, that nigga on they motherfucking ass, bro. Yes, yeah, sir. Nigga, yeah, you sir. had the Braves yesterday, though, didn't you? Yeah, man, we had the Braves yesterday, bro. Um, you know, and you went to the game, and I went to the game, right? Um, oh, that shit and the only reason I even mess with MLB, yes, because I've been so locked in on NBA playoffs, sure. bro. But I'm like, look, I'm in Atlanta. I want to fuck with the game, so we're going to fuck with the Braves on the exclusive. Um, the only reason I even went with the Braves, bro, they they took an L against the re uh, Rangers the previous game, right? Mm -hmm. So I was like, okay, are they going to drop two games in a row? No. Then I looked at the line on the Braves' money line, too. It was really, really juiced. So I was like, you know what? Fuck it. We're going to throw a hundred on the Braves, and we're going to watch that shit in live, and we're going to cash out, and we're going to celebrate. So, yeah, mm -hmm. shout out to the Braves. Hey, one thing about if you a black person and you go to a Braves game, that's where you're going to see white people not be racist at all. Yeah. Boy, white people love any black person who walk in that goddamn truest part. Yes, yes. Cool. Ain't no racism in there. That's true. That's, cool. That's very true. If, if, if the brave, now if the brave lose and you walk in that parking lot, <laughs> ain't no telling what might happen in your ass. But inside there, oh, nigga, they love you, boy. Yeah, the they atmosphere in that ballpark is crazy, man. It's one of my favorite uh, ballpark to visit for sure. For sure. Who y'all had on the fight, Haney or uh, Garcia? Cashed out, plus 450. I Woo! told you. I told you. You, you knew what was going to happen on ball. Bro, two fights ago, Haney lost. I can't f remember who he fought. Uh huh. But it was uh, not the last fight, but the fight before. Me and my partner watching that. Was it Lowe? Lo uh, huh? Was it was that him? He won yeah, that Lo fight. Alpha. I couldn't say his name. He won you know that fight. Me and my partner watching that shit, and I looked at him, I'm like, bro, Haney getting his ass whooped. Ended up giving them the uh, uh, the win or whatever, but I just I've been watching and following Garcia, bro. And again, he fought Tank already. You know what I mean? He did. So that kind of, and I saw that line going down because it was at five fifty, and it dropped. Went to five, then went to four fifty. I was like, oh yeah, let me jump on this real quick. Mm -hmm. Cash out, me and my partner. That's it's a great good. cash. That's a great cash. I'm gonna tell you the whole the fight and watching the first round, it was already looking bad. Right. But I was like, shit, Haney done survived that. I'm talking shit, because I'm a, I, Fuck it, the cat's out the bag. I'm pro-black. <laughs> <laughs> I said, shit, Haney finna knock his ass out. Round six round, I don't give a fuck how pro-black you is. <laughs> how, how down for the cause you is. How many bean pies you done ate. What, what you wear on your head. Nigga Garcia will beat his ass. <laughs> Yes, he was. I would that referee, the referee was even pro black. Pro -black. He was helping the nigga. Like, what get your ass up, nigga? The referee stopped after a while. Like, hey man, stop getting up. <laughs> the referee forgot he was mic'd up. The nigga was he said, but stop getting up, nigga. And like when Garcia started playing in the end, licking his tongue oh, yeah. out, bro, that's when I said, he don't have nothing for him. Because mm. if a nigga doing all that. Like, nigga, my folks in here, nigga, don't be fucking doing that shit, nigga. Hey, I'm telling you, can't none of them see Tank. No. Mm -mm. Nobody close right now to me. Tank might as well retire. Yeah. Because you ain't going to see, if you want to see good fights, just let these niggas keep fighting each other. <laughs> Real. Or let Tank fight both of them. <laughs> That's it. Send Thanks. this shit to the boxing commissioner. Let Tank fight Garcia and Haney at the same time. That's the only way we're going to see Tank in a good fight, bro. Because if you see when Haney was fighting Garcia, he was trying to hit him how Tank was hitting him in them, you know what I mean? Uh, body shots. Them body shots. Eating that shit. And that nigga went to eat that right. shit. Right. right. And everybody, man, shout out to my buddy T.O. Green. I seen a post they uh 
Hayden was talking about them three and a half pounds. Right. That nigga T.O. said, hey, man, I don't think them three and a half had shit to do with it. <laughs> nah, you got your bro, ass whooped. You got your ass whooped, your ass whooped bro. Whooped. If the shit was close, nigga, one judge had the mm -hmm. shit 115 to 109. And this ain't like basketball. Right. Nigga, 115 that's to 109. But that's, yeah, a, that's big, a big gap. Nigga, that gap bigger than that's mine. Hey, that, that card they kept showing on the screen, though, you saw that shit was even. It should have oh, been that close. But you, oh, yeah. but you see, it I was even. That. But when they went to the judges, that shit was lopsided on both yeah. of them cards they called. Lopsided nah, as a motherfucker. I agree. Man. Hey, what's up, man? This your boy, Nav Green, from Broken Plate Podcast. Hey, man. Back at it again. You know what time it is. It's prize picks time. And it's playoff time. Man, one single entry could change your life. I'm saying it because I believe it. Look at my boy Rich. He's over there focused right now because he know it's playoff time. With it being playoff time, you got so many games to choose from. You got Ant-Man. You got KD. You got Damian Lillard just went for 35 points in the first half. You got to take him over. Moving forward, you got to take him over. Man, it's available in over 30 states. What you waiting for, man? Guess what? Since we so cool and we family, if you use the broken play code, anything up to $100, they gonna match you. Anything up to $100, they gonna match you. You put $86, get what? You got another 86. What's that? 172. Oh, boy, he good. And you could be even better if you hit all six and win 25 times your money. Tell them Nav Green sent you from Broken Play. Nav Green, Wretched Ball, let's get some money. Playoffs done started. Yes. Hey, yeah. before we break down all the playoffs, we got to talk about this last game that all of us has, has seen. It was the last game being played. The Lakers versus the Nuggets. Mm. Bro, my heart goes out to LeBron. I don't know what the fuck you did. But these niggas not to fuck with you like this. <laughs> Bruh, it like this nigga is hated for some reason by his own teammate. Uh, okay. How you nigga just, bro? He's supposed that, to do it now. He's supposed to do it. He he's he's supposed to wear that crown. He's supposed to be the king. Nigga, what else could he do, right? Ah uh, shit, I don't know. That's what they look. That's 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 what the teammates looking for. They. He done hit two. Bro, he took him up when they was down. Oh, he he took him yeah, up yeah, 86 yeah. to 81. Yeah. He got to hit his free throws. Yeah. He got to hit his free throws, bro. Well, let me yeah, see. he got to hit his I free throws. I mean, but but let's keep it P, bro. Like, if you look at this Lakers team, bro, over the last couple of years, bro, what did you expect to change against the Nuggets, bro? They haven't gotten much better compared to two years ago or last year when they lost against the Nuggets. Nothing has changed. No. They have no answer for Jokic. Jokic literally roasts AD every chance he gets. And also, too, you have to remember, Bron is not, you know, in his prime like he once was, right? Like, Aaron Gordon does a pretty good job guarding LeBron. So when you look at the matchups between those two teams, it's like, I expect the Lakers to lose every single game. I'm, I'm being honest. Like, even if it's close, I expect them to lose. Nuggets can be down 20 points. I still going to expect the Nuggets to win the game. AD went crazy last night, though. He did, Eddie, but it Eddie, wasn't. Eddie, Eddie, what, what did Eddie AD Gray do game. in the second half? Uh, I don't know. I ain't gonna lie, I fell asleep on the second half. I cried my ass off. On that game? Man, I could not stay off the shit last night. So look, tell me this. What what you see the series going, man? Like, just from your... I'm gonna be honest with you. I think this series might go five games. I think Lakers are gonna win one. They might win game three. In LA? Yeah, game three in LA. Mm -hmm. That's going to be the game that they have the highest possible chances of winning, right? Bro, this like, last game, though, you up 20. Bro, that don't mean shit, bro. You see in the first game, Lakers were up almost 20 points. What Nuggets did, bro? Second and half, they, they turn up. And I ain't going to lie, I got caught. Second half, it was a nine and a half spread. I said, shit, I got to take the Lakers with these plus nine and a half. What? Mm. Show me. Motherfucker showed my head right to bed. <laughs> 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 Nigga, you got to... Bro, and you said it last time you said, you got to stop betting with your fucking heart. Well, um, something you also got to look at too, right? Especially when you're betting, um, when you're betting NBA basketball, you have to look at the the balance of money, right? Mm -hmm. Meaning that you usually never going to see a team win every single quarter, right? Mm -hmm. Meaning that the chances of them winning the first quarter, second quarter, third quarter, fourth quarter is slim to none. There has to be a balance of money. 
right? So usually you might see a team win the first half, second half, and they end up losing the game or whatever, right? So when you live bet, and that's always something you should always consider too, right? Look at the quarters, look at the outcome of the quarters. And, and I'm saying, I think nature. live betting them messed up the the total game outcomes too, because sometimes like if a game starting mm-hmm. off fast mm-hmm. and a lot of people start taking the over, yeah. you'll just see the game slow down. Yeah, I believe it. Yeah, it, I mean that's it. that, bro. It, it happens every time, bro. Like let's say for example, you got an over and under on the line at two thirty, right? Game starts, these niggas can score twenty points in six minutes, right? That line's gonna jump from two thirty all the way to probably about two thirty eight, two forty. That's a great opportunity to jump in right there. Like, don't care about, like, I know they came out hot, but understand that that game is going to slow down at a certain point um, in the second half. But live betting, man, it can be very dangerous, bro. I'm telling you, like, you really have to be very careful. But some a way to, you know, really be really effective at live betting, mm-hmm. write down the actual lines of the game before the game start, right? So if the line for a game is eight points and over and under is 230, Write that down. Watch the game, right? First quarter, look, see what the live line is. Second quarter, see what the live line is. Because there's going to be an opportunity where you can get really, really great value. Because when these games end, they end pretty close to the actual line, bro. Like, oh, yeah. really, really close, right? right. Game one, uh, Knicks, 76ers, right? The over and under. It, it, was, it was a one-point difference between the over and under, right? But there were opportunities in that game at halftime, first quarter, second quarter, where you could have gotten really, really good value if you wanted to live. So don't just live bet without having a game plan. Write down the actual line. That way you're able to see Niggas got to take this shit seriously. You, you, you just can't be, bro, you, you got to treat it like a business, Niggas man. just be gambling. You got to treat it like a business, bro. If you, <laughs> if you just gambling, you going to lose mad bread, bro. bro. But look, you know how you, you, you tell people when you see people make the same mistake? I'm like... I was telling this nigga this the last time. So you, was, <laughs> you was telling you, you was you trying to put me on game, and I'm still fucking up. But you know how sometimes I think that's why it's gambling because you just start chasing. Yeah. yeah. If, you, if you if you get them couple losses, like it, it's yeah, in yeah. it's in us to chase. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's human nature for like sure. It's part of it. Uh, I feel like let's talk about it. I think the seven sixes got cheated. I agree. Uh, yeah. Bro, it's no way. And Amen. before I say the 76ers got cheated, MB, you are the best player in the NBA. Pause. Nope. Disagree. I ain't going to go that far, but I got a lot more respect for him. Yeah. A lot more respect for him. Who, who y'all put in front of MB? He, I told you, we talked SGA. It, uh, SGA in front of MB? Yes. SGA. Nah. Anthony Edwards. Nah. Nah. Bro, Bro, what was it? His second year? I wouldn't put SGA. SGA who, second year? Nah, nah, it's like his fourth. It's like his fourth. He's been in the league for a minute. Yeah. SGA up there, bro. Bro, SGA is cold. He's cold. Listen I'm to not me. Last two years, this man been going crazy, SGA bro. is that deal. Yeah, yeah. But, no. MB, did y'all see MB? No, he went crazy. He went crazy. I'll tell you, here's who I'll put over MB. I'll put Jokic over MB. Yes. I'll put Luka. I, I'll put Luka over MB. I'll give you Jokic. That. I can't give you Luka. You, you, you got to put Luka, man. Luka, I don't got to The way, way Luka... <laughs> bro. <laughs> bro. The way Luka controls the game, bro, number yes, one, he's he a point. So he has the ball. He, he knows he's going to get to. MB needs the ball to get to his spots. When you look at Luka, the impact he has on the game, the way he's able to break down defense, the way he's a, a walking mismatch. He's 6'8", 240, can shoot, can pass. Man, Luka. He, why he won MVP? I mean, if, why he if, ain't been to the final? I mean, and B won one MVP last year, right? That, 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 and he was in, and he got cheated one year. Bro, you really think Embiid's better than Luka? Yeah, I would, I, I would, I would give him that edge on that one. Who? On that head to head, Embiid. Embiid yes. over Luka is crazy. I would, I would give him an edge. Luka ain't showed me. Hey, I'm telling you, Luka, last night, I'm a Luka look, fan. Night, Luka, I'm a Luka fan. I don't want this to get twisted. I'm a Luka fan, but when it come to just talking, like, bro, Luka got all the skill set, all that. Now, if we going skill set, Luka better than Absolutely. most of them niggas. Absolutely. But when we talking about an all around player who I'm taking before. I'm taking him B before him. I'm taking Ant Man before him. It's just, bro, Luca niggas don't be saying Luca might go nine for thirty, bro. When and have, have ten turnovers? Luca have games like that. Very streaky, bro. Luca is a walking forty ten, bro. He had a run. On he had a run. Now. James Harden had a run, I don't, but I don't, bro, no, Luca's I'm talking the, about Luca. Luca got a run. Luca's the closest thing to LeBron that we have. 
when you look at Prom LeBron, the impact that he has on the game, Luca's oh, the closest thing. You for real? I'm dead serious. You rap with <laughs> I ain't with yeah, yeah. Am I tripping? Yeah, for real. Yeah. I think you are. Am I, yeah. Am I tripping? Like, bro, Luca is <laughs> Luca. Oh, oh. Hey, Luca the one. Yo ass bro, a whole listen, bunch of money. I don't want you to think I'm hey, <laughs> I don't want you to think I'm tripping. Luca is very cold. Right. I feel like how we been like, like, bro. Luca, Luca, good. What's your what's your problem with Luca? Like, if, the nigga if, just if, ain't did shit. <laughs> he just been having great games like niggas what, what, supposed what, to do. What have MB done? Aside yeah. from winning the MVP bro, that Jokic should have won. Listen, they show MB knee. That nigga knee is swole. So you tell me, this nigga had twenty eight points in twenty eight minutes. On one leg, he averaging a point a minute. One leg. On a bad leg. So that's why he can't he, be stopped. That's why he's better than Luka because of an injury? No, not because of the injury. Just because this nigga skill set. This nigga seven foot. In the body of work. He going off the body Shoot of work. Threes. The impact of the game. Coming to you the cup. I mean? Bro, can't accomplishments. Be, this on a bad knee. Imagine yeah. that nigga knee good. His knee was good last year. What happened? Man, them niggas didn't come to play. <laughs> I, hey, look. I'm going to tell you who the real problem is for the 76ers, though. Ooh. Tobias Harris. Oh, uh, nigga, you ain't got to say shit. I mean... You ain't figure I, shit out. <laughs> <laughs> bro, hey, Tobias, what's up with Harris Tobias Harris bro? is stealing money. This nigga stealing money. And not money, just bro. him, chubby ass Kyle Lowry too. <laughs> oh, that nigga... Kyle Lowry. No, Kyle that's Lowry, Lowry right. boy. I'm, you don't retire, I'm nigga. Man, come on, man. Don't, don't, don't give my guy Kyle too much, man. I'm he, confused he, about that one. Uh, I don't know what I do. <laughs> He hustle. He plays yeah, hard. Hustle. You he think he hustling? <laughs> nigga, that's all he got. Y'all see, see when he flopped, when uh, MB tried to push him to play defense. This nigga, Lowry, flopped. He ain't know them B trying. You know, <laughs> this nigga did. Threw himself on the ground, bro. bro. It's a Kyle Lowry. It is. Hey. I don't know. I mean, but look, though. They going back to Philly. The series not over. You feel me? The series so not look, over. They did what they're true. supposed to do. Do you think, do you think Luka is better than Ant-Man? I would take Luca over Ant. I would too. I would, I would take Luca over Ant. I, and uh, I'm gonna say this: How y'all do that? It's, 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 it's the only reason. It's something. I'm, I'm saying if we start in the team, yeah. but who I like better? I like Ant Man. Ant Man has dog in him. Who do you know? Tell KD. Can't follow but your old ass can't guard me. <laughs> yeah, and, and, no, and I'm talking. Hey, you out of all people. Bro, I'm telling you, Reggie. Skill. They going <laughs> off skill set. That's why all I'm saying. Skill uh -huh. set wise. Luca is everything. But I'm saying, none of that shit matter if a nigga can't win. Why he couldn't beat the Clippers without Kawhi? Bro, but it's a lot of dudes in the league that don't oh, win, nah, it's so bro. Many excuses. <laughs> it, it's not even the excuse, bro. Like, the only exception is Jokic, Braun, and, and bro, it's a handful of guys. The whole league don't win, bro. It's only one team no, that's going to win a championship. Win, nigga. You ain't even beat the Clippers. That eight-point eight quarter probably ain't sitting right with my dog. Yeah. Right now, bro. Listen. It was an eight-point quarter. Hit, hit, bro, hit. on some real shit, that's really Kyrie team. Yes, it is. What? Bro. Bro, Kyrie. Hey, without Kyrie, they don't have a shot. Bro, but, but, but how can you say that, bro? Because every team that competes, they need that number two. Mm. Hey, look. Why you think Jalen Brunson going to fuck off in New York? Because he ain't got to play with Luka holding the motherfucking ball the whole 23 seconds, then you throw it to a nigga. At the, hey, ain't nobody playing like that, nigga. Luka is James Harden, bro. That We seen what success James Harden had. He was the nicest nigga, the coldest, the killer. But what success he done had. And it's, it's, I'm surprised because at first I'm thinking Luka is LeBron. But then he like, oh, no, he James Harden. He the coldest in the league, but... And Luca got well, an attitude do for problem. Him. That nigga might make no a bad. He might make a bad pass, and he mad at them niggas. Like, bro, that's your fucking fault. <laughs> I mean, talking about shit to Luke, the real. Luca's young though, bro. He's only them, he's only what twenty two. Oh no, nah, he's still young. That's what you know, I'm saying. He, but he's been a pro since. Luca's gonna win a couple of championships. How old is he? He's over. He's like twenty three, bro. He's what? super. He, yeah, he's oh, he young. That's why I say skill set wise. Luca's cold, bro. And he he got more to go. That's why I say I ain't. I'm not saying Luca not not that nigga. Yeah. But I just like a lot of people over. Luca might have multiple 25. seven point games. He's 25, okay, that's but that's still. He's 25. That's still young. That's still young. That's still young. Yeah, bro. Fuck. He's just now getting into his. He's not. He probably not even his prime yet. Nah. He's probably gonna hit nah, his prime at 27, prime, 28. Mm -hmm. And yeah. I saw that nigga drop. Wow, 73. Boy, that's, that, 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 that. Against the Hogs. You hey, was at the game. Hey, you posted about it. And you, and you sitting incredible. here and you telling me that MB's that better than Luca, bro? Nigga, 
nigga. Listen, if MB want to do that, he could have did that. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't he drop 70? Yes, he did. He dropped yes, 70 he also. Bro, he dropped 70 against oh. the Hawks. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it don't matter who. They in the NBA? Yeah, it don't matter. You <laughs> ain't like he playing against some college team, nigga. He playing against the same team that these other niggas got a chance to play, play against. You niggas could get 70 if you want. You San niggas Antonio. don't want it. San Antonio. San Antonio. Oh, yeah. So, he did it again with Wimby. Yep, yep. That was a big deal. Hey, let me ask you this. The, uh, right. the series, right, uh, against the, the Suns and the T-Wolves, right? Mm -hmm. um, what are your thoughts about that series? It, it, it might go down. I think that series might go seven games. Yeah. I believe that. I think, uh, yeah, yeah, I yeah. think with that, Phoenix, what people, a lot of people don't realize, Phoenix still figuring out what the fuck they going to do. Yeah, I agree. And, and when they figure it out... The only thing with Minnesota, Minnesota play defense, dog. I agree. And they play defense without fouling. I'm watching them niggas. They play defense without fouling. And you know why the, another reason why they team going to go far? Because niggas ain't guessing what niggas need to do. They, hey, Ant-Man, this your team. He the closer. Mm. You, he the hey, closer. You, hey yeah. car in the town, all that skill set you got, nigga, you ain't got no heart. Yeah. So Ant-Man going to... Ant Man gonna drive this motherfucking boat. Yeah. And, he, and guess why? Guess why they gonna win? Cause Carl Anthony Town, he cool with it. That nigga ain't argue back or yeah. nothing. He and know you go better. to them other nigga team. He know better. Well, my, my problems with the Suns, bro, they've been trying to figure it out all year. Yeah. You know, like too inconsistent. Like who who's the number one on let me ask you, who's the number one on that team? Is it Book or is it KD? KD. Bro, bro. it's KD. It gotta but, be. It gotta but be. Even book. KD wanted to be booked. Book right. gotta be the number one. But cause like, cause nigga, He's KD point. feel like I'm I'm older. I'm older. <laughs> book, you got all the skill set, but it just sometimes niggas don't want to goddamn be in that that position where niggas like could be able to talk about them. Mm. Niggas sometimes niggas don't want to be criticized. KD been criticized His for the long. He don't give a fuck no more. KD don't. Nah, KD don't give a fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. KD, you, you can tell KD. KD don't give a fuck because he'll get right on Twitter and respond to everything <laughs> he <can> say. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like, yeah, yeah. some niggas want to be a good guy. But after you done been a bad guy so long, you can stop giving a fuck. Nah, yeah. facts. Facts. I see, um, I think that's the only one uh, that might get closest, that Tim Wood and Suns. Yeah, I think that series going to go seven. Um, yeah, that's a, a good chance. That Celtics seven. heat, that's over with. Uh, and the only reason why I say it's over with, man, they role players shooting the peel off that bitch. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I'm I'm just going to throw this out there. I like the Celtics to win it all. We got a future on the Celtics, 150K paying off 500K. So, that ain't bad. Uh, I, I don't know I just, about against Denver, though. Nuggets got to go to the finals. Who going to stop them? Who's going to stop the Nuggets? It's a couple teams. It's a couple teams. I think. Um, I think the. Clip, I, some I think. I think. No, no. I, I'm, I'm gonna tell. I'm oh. gonna tell. I'm gonna tell you the couple teams that can, you know, give the Nuggets some problems, right? Um, I think the Clippers, if they're able to beat the Mavs, I think the Clippers can give the Nuggets some serious problems. You have Kawhi; he's gonna be fully healthy. Kawhi, man, Kawhi is such a, a a difference maker. I think that series can possibly go to six to seven games, right? So I think the Nuggets and the Clippers. I think Clippers can possibly win that series. If the Suns were to beat the the T Wolves, I think Suns Nuggets is also going to be a good matchup where they can give Nuggets some problems. So you got to remember, Nuggets don't have the same team from last year, right? They had Bruce Brown, he's a vet, right? They don't have him no more. They had Jeff Green, he's a vet. They don't have him no more. When I look at the Nuggets bench, that's my biggest uh, question mark with the Nuggets is their bench. All season long, their bench their bench was ranked what like bottom bottom twenty in the league. Like pull it up. If you look at the Nuggets bench, that's a huge question mark, right? You got uh, what's the rookie name coming off the bench, right? You got a rook, and then you got a you got another. Rook. I don't trust the Nuggets bench, man. I don't trust their bench. I feel like they need I, I, more. I give you that. Okay, those the two, Celtics those two, two got a better bench. That's Celtics true. have a way better bench, man. When Definitely. I look at the Celtics one through five, they're a walking mismatch. And nigga, KP, uh, Porzingis? Porzingis. I mean, come on, man. Like you got Porzingis, Shit. you got you got Derek White. He started off so hot. Against uh the damn heat. You know, like so I don't know. I just don't see nobody beating the Celtics. Hey, I'm gonna tell you this the Cavs versus Magic. <laughs> and I thought that shit was gonna be more competitive than what it was. <laughs> that nigga Donovan Mitchell, it's like it? he been bullshitting all year till it was playoff time. Childish, bro. Yeah, he like, oh yeah, I'm gonna show you niggas what's up. You think that series is over with? Yeah. Yeah. 
Right. Really? I don't they know. No, Orlando is a different team at home, not, bro. I hope they are. Orlando. Because <laughs> I don't know who the fuck. Orlando plays a lot better at home, bro. But look, though, the Cavs, the Cavs did what they supposed to do, bro. Like, you're supposed to win. The series don't really start till game three. Till game three. But all the home teams have won. Right. You see that. Right. But it's some home teams are looking... Totally. <laughs> Some home teams looking like it don't matter where we play. This little, right? and, and Cleveland, just, Cleveland, another team with with a lot of defense too. I mean, if Cleveland win this matchup against the Magic, who they gonna face the the Knicks, bro? The Knicks is uh, no, slaughter. If who? If Cleveland beat the if Cleveland beat the yeah, they have to play the Celtics. It will be the Celtics. Yeah, come on, man. Cavs not going nowhere, bro. Like that's. They got a solid team, though, bro. That, bro, that team ain't going nowhere, bro. After the first round, they not beating anybody else in the East. They solid, boy, bro. Boy, that they... liquor coming through me, boy. <laughs> <He's> solid. <laughs> Shit. They solid. <laughs> Jared, you trust you trust Jared Allen? You seen his comment last Hell year against no. the Knicks. What he said, the lights were too big. I don't trust none of these niggas. Nah. I don't trust none of these niggas, but Ant Man. I'm, I'm, like, I'm like how these women on Twitter be. I don't trust no nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Min hey, Minnesota. I might gamble with you, nigga, but I don't trust you, nigga, man. Nah, what you finish that down there? Minnesota, the yes. like what man you said, Minnesota, like the only ones who I can see. Beating the Nuggets. That's a yes. they got the trouble. Yeah. Cause they got the inside and well, Joker yeah. got a guard. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Like, like that net was speaking on. It's a good got point. Reed. Yep. And they got nice. they got, got three niggas to throw at mm -hmm. Yeah, and they got they got height, height all up and down. And they do. And then Could... you got somebody like Michael Conley, who's a veteran. Mike Conley, right. who's still yeah. like mm -hmm. you know what I mean. Yep. Nah, T Wolves got, got, got a they got, they have a well built team. Like you made a good team. point. Like everybody know they roll right. You got mm -hmm. a true you got right. a true point in Mike Conley. Right. You got a true closer in and you got they a true number team. two in um. You know, yeah. Towns. Mm -hmm. You got Nas Reed. To me, I think, you know, he should be the sixth man. I know yeah. Malik Monk yeah, is probably going to get it. Yeah. But we when I look at Nas Reed, too. you know, impact, Nas he's Reed's probably. a very good sixth man, very bro. He, he's a he's a starter in his league, bro. Mm -hmm. I think he's a starter in his league. So, yeah, T-Wolves, they have a good roster, man. It's not it's not a walk in the park to the finals for the Nuggets this year, man. But you you think it's one for the Celtics? On the oh, East. yeah, in the East, 100%. What about the... Nigga, hey, Damian Lillard. Yeah. Damian Lillard. Yeah. <laughs> Nigga, I don't know if you and Glorilla got some shit going on, but nigga, after she posted herself with your jersey on, nigga, you been on fucking five. Nigga dropped 35 Sometimes in the first half. Sometimes you need a ratchet cheerleader in your corner <laughs> for, for to make a nigga just believe he can be all he want to be. Culture. <laughs> all you niggas want all the baddest No, get you a ratchet bitch who gonna talk that shit. <laughs> Talking into your life. Yeah, them, them pretty ones. And I'm a, I'm a, I gotta refrain from using the word. Because I don't want nobody. A pretty queen comes to the game. They sit there and just sit there and they watch the game. They don't get emotional when you miss a shot. Nigga, if Glorilla see that nigga Dame, look, baby, you got him. <laughs> she going to talk life into the nigga. Low Lily. He starts shooting that bitch from the other side. Boy dropped 35 first, yeah, half. first half. First half. First half. That was, was she come. did. I see you. <laughs> say, oh, this shit locked up. He gonna get a feature from him? No, he be rapping. Oh, nah, yeah, he, he be cold. rapping too. He cold. Uh, he cold. Nah, I don't want to see them rap. <laughs> anytime people start rapping together, the relationship don't yeah. work. Moneybag, yo, and Megan the Stallion, that shit Down split. The drain. Then you had goddamn Offset and Carter B. They argue every other week. So it's just like you just leave them relationship long. Sweetie and Quavo. You can't mix business with yeah, business. Yeah, you can't with mix business, business with pleasure. Yeah, business with pleasure. Can't. That's fine. When we got damn come back, I'm a goddamn. I'm finna go ring this shirt out real quick. When we come back, <laughs> wow, I've been drinking so much, motherfucker. Boy, hey, like hey, 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 you, you was sweating time, over there like crazy, boy. Hey, I'm like, why is this nigga sweating? So hey, hard? I'm finna put this goddamn channel out. Look, <laughs> <laughs> some of these lights off in there, yo. Shit. When we come back, we gonna talk about who we got, who we got winning the MVP. The defensive player of the year, the Rick of the year, and the most improved player. I see that nigga Thad can't spell. He put M O P. <laughs> Marcel. It's supposed to be M I P. Yeah. Who we got? Six man clutch player. Damn. Steph Curry didn't even make it to the playoffs. Right. It's the end of a dynasty. You Clay, think? Absolutely. Clay Thompson is out. Absolutely. Where you gonna be at? Um, I think a couple of good fits. The Orlando Magic, they need more shooting. That would be a good fit. Hey, come to the house. Hey, come to the house. Please. Come, come to, to the house. house. Yeah, we'll find please. out when we come back on Broken. <laughs> <laughs>
a sweater that Beijing off of this motherfucker. Oh, <laughs> hey, so when we were arguing, you said Luca and Joker, Manny. Mm -hmm. Who you got MVP then? Jokic. I got Jokic MVP. I think SGA deserves it. He gonna get it. Um, but I think Jokic is gonna get it. I'm gonna tell you, man, they get tired of getting the same nigga the award. <laughs> SGA, he got the number one seed. Nobody saw that coming. You expect Joker to do what he doing. SGA, he he ran that team all year. What's the odds for uh MVP right now? Let's look at it. Let me pull it up right now. Um, Cause you gotta pay. You gotta pay attention. You need a nigga like that round. Um, all that talking, nigga. Put your you money. You gotta, you gotta look place. at that, bro. You gotta look at that. Look, they don't even have it. So it's about to be a nap. What's the odds right now? Who's a uh, favorite? No, he nah, can't, can't be. No, 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 That nigga ain't paying oh, mail. No, 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 The Lord of number. The yeah. Lord of number is the favorite. Yeah, yeah bro. Okay. So if it's like minus some, that's who the favorite. Right. Yeah, Joker at minus 6,600. Oh, yeah, he the favorite then. Exactly, bro. Out the water. Exactly, bro. So you might get that. So you got it. He might already got that. But look, though, that's why I said Jokic is going to win. I think SGA deserves it. So what is going to win? SGA, he's at plus 3,000. Yeah, bro. It's Jokic, bro. Jokic. I can try my book. Hell yeah, boy. Yeah, I'm going to hold on it. Hey, you make, real quick. You dropping a hundred, you literally making a donation to the, uh, to the sports books. Man. Shit, smart, I've been bro. doing that all year, nigga. <laughs> Shit, I've been, doing, I've been doing that shit all you, 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 fam, <laughs> right. fam, you making a donation. I know a lot of y'all looking, you know, emotional. You want SGA, blah, 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 bro. Don't, don't, don't donate your money to the uh, sports book. Don't do that. You so literally pull up the numbers. Why, why is Joker reason? such a lock, though? I could tell you why. Because Murray was hurt most of the season. Well, not, not necessarily, bro. If you just look at the numbers, bro, like the impact, if you look, you got to look at, uh, you got to look at metrics, bro. So like with NBA, you just don't want to look at the records, but you want to look at how effective a player is when he's on the floor, right? Um, his efficiency, um, you want to look at that also. When I look at SGA, yes, he's playing lights out or whatever, but look at his shots attempt, right? I don't, I'm not just looking at the points or whatever. I'm looking at his shots at him. Then I'm also looking at the team that he has, bro. He's supposed to do all those things. When mm -hmm. I look at Jokic, the Nuggets are not going anywhere without Jokic. Now, you can make the same argument about SGA, but Jokic is just way more efficient and more, more consistent, bro. That's yeah, your MVP. He's a better player, but I'm saying what, SGA what, ain't why, why, why does SGA deserve the MVP over Jokic? They're number one. Nobody, nobody expected them niggas to be OKC's number one. OKC's the fakest number one probably in the last 10 years. Oh, well, them niggas number hey, one. They, they been balling, hey, number bro. one, they playing the same me, team no, the you, other you, niggas playing. They been balling, bro. But look at this, bro. Look at number one through number six in the West, bro. It's probably a two to three game difference, bro. Oh, yeah, it's close. Yeah, that's so, a great point. That's a great point. When you look at that, bro, it's not like they're a number one like the Celtics where it's like 10 games, bro. You got to look at that shit, bro. Y'all niggas don't be looking at that, bro. Niggas bro. be like, number one, number eight, all right, number one. No, no. bro. Listen. Look at the difference between games when you're talking right, so about number me, one. With a straight face, you saw... OKC being in the top three seeds. I'm going to be honest with you. Is I did not see them being top three, but I felt like they were going to compete. You you probably got them in that five, six. Yeah, five, slot. six, yeah. They but, one, one. but once again, the five, the between five to number who one is literally points? a two game difference. Tell me who leading in points. As for, what you mean by SGA, that? 30.1, right? You talking about team or? No, points per game. Points per game. Luca. Luca led the league in scoring. He did? Bro, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm just yeah, asking Luka, them the top three things. We talking about everybody. We talking about uh, uh, SGA and Joker. No, I'm talking about scoring. Uh, I'm not just scoring. Them two. I'm talking about the Luka, Luka yeah, then who? Giannis. And then who? And then SGA. So SGA and three. Okay. Uh, Would you change your pick? Where's Joker? Joker, he 10. 10. But he at, but it was like 27, 28? Like 26, I think. 26. 26, 9. Yeah. Rebounds, assists. Yeah, Joker up there. I bet he top three in that probably. Field goal percentage. Yeah. From the eye, I feel, I'm feeling from the eye, it look like it should go to SG. But when you I break agree. it down. You look at the numbers yeah, and everything. It's Joker's it clear. Yeah, so bonus yeah. leads and rebounds. Go Bears number two, AD is number three, and Joker's number four. Okay. Um, but what about assists? Top top ten in the Jokic probably top ten in the Halliburton's number one, Lucas number two, and Joker's number three. Yeah. So look, this is all I'm gonna say. 
Now, I see what everybody's saying. But in that case, why did they cheat LeBron all them years when LeBron had that same? So it's like, it don't, I hear what you're saying about the metrics and all that makes yeah. sense. But in that sense, they've been cheating LeBron all them damn years. Nah, I he agree. was top Facts. three and all that shit Facts. for yeah. a lot of years. Bron Facts. Bron should have won five MVPs in a row, but like you said, voters fatigue. You know what I mean? That is mm. a real thing. 100%. I think this probably going to be Jokic last year winning an MVP. Yeah. I'm being honest yeah, with it's you. It's hard to see him not This number three? Yeah, this will nah, be his third. This will be his third. Oh, yeah. This number three. I'm putting 250 on that SGA this, shit. This, <laughs> this, this guy's a no. real gambler. <laughs> they want they want a hey, they trying to keep niggas happy right now. No, I'm for real. No, I'm for real. And, and, European and players young. are taking over the league hey, right now, bro. And, and, they are. And, 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 no real yeah, nigga. Yeah. No. They're like, this will keep them quiet. Yep. Yep. <laughs> 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 SGA from Canada, man. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like, <laughs> Them niggas they ain't gonna know. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm so dead. You, guys, so like, you just got a mind fuck up to keep up. Like, hey, why, why are they taking over our league? We get to talking like all that. Right. Hey, man. But no, nah, all Joe's side, we talking shit, but Joker. I think hands down, we we all can come to agreement that Joker is the best player in the league. You watch the nigga, he don't, bro, he don't get tired. He don't get tired. You watch the nigga, the nigga don't even be sweating. Mm -hmm. Real effortless, mm -hmm. nigga. Effortless. He don't jump high. Mm -hmm. don't nigga, he bad. sit there and play cool. Mm -hmm. he, he, he controls the game. Absolutely. When they but, need to score, he'll get it and bag you down. Boom, boom, boom. So, mm -hmm. Like he straight yeah, to it. He's a dog. Don't let his shot be falling. Oh, oh bitch, you good in luck. <laughs> good luck. All right, defensive player of the year. Who y'all got? Who wanna go go first? Yeah. Wimby. I, I like Wimby. <laughs> Wimby. That's that's remarkable. All them blocks Wimby. per game. So you think they gonna get him defensive player of the year and rookie? Of the I don't year? think they will. No, I don't think they will. Who is I think who else will. is up for the rookie of the year? Uh, they got Bam and Gobert. Shit. Shit. I agree. I think Wemby should get the defensive player of the year. He gonna get it. I just but, thought about it. But I think they're gonna give it a go bear. Just cause not to give a nigga two awards. They done did it before. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It might be his coming yeah, out party, it's, man. It's, we know what he gonna be, bro. Go bear. We know what he's gonna be. Blocks right now. It's five people in front of him. It's Wemby is number one. Walker Kessler's number two, Brooke Lopez number three, AD number four, and Shed is number five. Yeah, but when I gotta give them both of them. You uh, another thing that they look at with the defensive players is just not, you know, blocks, right? Mm -hmm. um, you also look at, you know, shots that they're able to alter, right? right. So shots that, you know, they jump, it was, a, it was, it was, a, even though the shot wasn't blocked, but it had an impact on that shot right. being missed, right? And then what other teams do against them? Like, if you watch Minnesota scores, it ain't a lot of high scoring yeah, scores. Yeah, bro, and it's for a reason, bro. Right. Like, Gorbear so be like literally... like an anchor on yeah, that defense. Gobert, a lot of niggas, we ain't even finna try him like that. That's yeah. a good point, because Gorbear, bro, he changes, he changes team's game plan, bro. You you playing the T-Wolves, bro, you thinking twice about, you know, going into that paint. Same with Wimby, of course, but Gobear, bro, the way he anchors that whole defense for the T-Wolves uh, and the impact he has against other teams that are playing them, it's crazy, bro. I know Go Bears hate it a lot. Like, like Twitter don't like him. Like, they think the nigga started Corona. Nigga. Whole, like, I get it. But <laughs> when you look at his impact on the defensive end and how he impacts a game, bro, he's a huge portion of you know why they may win a game. Mm -hmm. um, how, so how I think you they gonna give it to him. My bad, I mean to cut you off. How you factor in that help though? Because we just talked about how deep Minnesota is. Okay. You feel what I'm saying? We talking about these individual wars. Okay. Shit, Minnesota, they they got three guys. You know what I mean? You got to account for it when you're talking about, you know, post play okay. or altering shots or okay. just That's stepping true. up in defense. Wimby by himself, you know what I mean, is must watch what? TV. That nigga playing with <laughs> <some> AAU. <laughs> <niggas. Yeah. laughs> nah, I, 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 I agree. I, I agree with that. But um, I think you also have to add in team success. And I think a lot of people aren't That's adding that. If you're going to add in mm -hmm. team success That's for true. the MVP for the league, you have to add in team success but for defensive, defensive player also as well. And another thing, I feel you man, on that. why you saying that, which this might sound crazy, but with Wimby, bro, them be freak of nature type of blocks. Exactly, bro. Only a nigga <laughs> like, who, only a nigga who's 7'6 <laughs> is gonna make them bro, block. Some of that shit he do, bro. bro like, nobody like, else is doing that shit. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Bro. Like, nigga, you yeah. be having good shots. Like, Why don't come on, man. <laughs> this nigga. 
Now, nah, Wimby should win it, bro. But the only reason he's not gonna win is because of his team. His team not ain't successful. doing shit. I feel the anchor, it. I feel anchor it. Deep, the anchor I feel of the it. defense is valuable as hell. Like, yeah, yeah. That, for now on, I'll be looking at that when it Wimby's comes gonna to win it. a couple, bro. He might win it next year, bro. Yeah. But but see, okay, when we were just talking about getting tired of, uh, you know, like uh, voters fatigue, like yeah. you were saying, you think they tired of hearing go Burton? They ain't want to try somebody new, or it's too soon? Nah, not not, not necessarily. I think Wimby just too young for them to be like. All right. I mean, him this. that's this true, year, but we're going to have to get this nigga this shit a lot of more years because right. he's going to get better right. every year. And ain't nobody going to be able to do this shit he doing. But if the if the Spurs were to make the play in or be uh, in the playoffs, he, he would have gotten it. I yeah, swear. Easily. Like okay. 100%. Ricky of the year. Wimby, easily. Agree. And no question that. Say it at the beginning. And I said season. that at the beginning. Said it at the beginning. Niggas was telling me, chat. Shit. I said, hey, Wimby. Ain't no way. Mm -hmm. Most improved player. I would have to go Kobe White. I agree. Kobe White, 100%. I like Buddy. I like Kobe. Very exciting. I've been mm -hmm. like Kobe since Kobe high White. school. Yeah. Well, I would say this though. Like, Kobe White always was able to get bucket. With Zach Levine getting hurt, it really allowed him to blossom into that yeah, star. Yeah, bro. Yeah. He's always yeah. been a bucket, He's bro. A bucket. It's just the opportunity to be that true up. number two. Because you playing on a Bulls team, bro. You got He was like the number four, bro. Right. You, got, he, you got Zach. You got DeRozan. You got their center. Then it was Kobe, right? And before they came here, it, Kobe was the man before... um. I think the Rose and one of them was no, no, there. no. It was it it was uh it, now nah, Kobe wasn't a number two. You had Zach, and then you had their center um that came from the Magic, uh, right. Nikola Vucevic. Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. right. But so Kobe he was, was the number two. Co yeah, so Kobe he he was there, but now Kobe's in a true number two. Like it's not even a question, mm -hmm. right? You know who's your number and two? And you see, he got game. He got oh, game. We ain't got to even talk yeah, no more. He got game. He got game. Oh, you think he got? Yeah. He done made the jump. He he, he got. Was Max like, was Max an All Star though last year? He wasn't an all star. Um, I think he was all star this year, yeah, his first. But when I look at Maxi last year, though, he, you, you, you seeing the star yeah, potential, yeah, right? Yeah. Like you, he you. was averaging at least, he you. averaged at least twenty last year. Maxi was you. doing that last year. Yeah. Harden jump. was just in the fucking way. In yeah. a way, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Exa because exa Harden wasn't even a number two. Maxi was the number two. <laughs> Nigga ain't a number three. <laughs> <Man>. <laughs> For six men, Malik Monk. He's gonna win it. Yeah, he's gonna. He gonna win. Malik gonna win it. I like Nas better. I like Nas. Malik gonna win it though. Shit, you Shit if y'all like Nas better, like why not go with him? I like Nas Reed. You said what now? I like, I like Bobby, Bobby Porter's too. too. Bobby B. But they gonna down. give it to Malik. They gonna give it to Malik. Bobby Porter's like that, that's Malik. the people's champ type shit right there. Malik, I don't think Malik is gonna come back to the Kings. I think he's gonna get a bigger contract. He's gonna go to another team where his role can be expanded a little bit more because he's in the prime of his career. I, I see what you're saying. He's not coming back to the he Kings. I'm willing to bet whatever. I think he should stay though. He's not. He's not. He's one of them guys. I think come. Be he's better off the of bench. I agree, one hundred percent. But let me ask you this, bro: If you're yeah. in your prime, bro, and you balling the way you're balling, you telling me you're not gonna chase? Oh the no, you're gonna make some money. Of course, I'm, I'm, I'm I don't think cash he could, I don't think he, the the way he play. I don't think he could start off like that in a, in a starting role. Yeah, but, but shit, nigga could make me. You know what I mean? There a believer. But I think like his game is. He play a lot of one on one. He does. Right? He does. He and so does. it's like shit. You get that from the beginning. Your team might be down twenty every goddamn game. <laughs> I mean, but look at look he got at, game. He he not coming off the bench because he need to be. You know what I'm saying? He, he coming off the sister. bench because it's it I would say this: Don't be surprised if Malik uh, Malik Monk get the bag that Jordan Poole got. What's the difference? You right. You definitely right. Malik not, Monk better than Jordan Poole. Right. It's a better, it's a better, it's a better risk to give hey him man, that money. Jordan Poole is okay, hey man. Don't just shit on my dog. Uh, yeah, like I that, don't man. know, bro. <laughs> I'm not saying Malik. I'm not saying Malik. I agree. I agree. Not with better you, now, yeah. but Jordan Poole Jordan just Poole, ain't this. Bro, I watch Wizards games. <laughs> he he doesn't play winning basketball. His his Jordan Poole shot selections <laughs> IQ. Yeah, I think this coach gonna do him a lot of good though, bro. Didn't they just get a new coach in the middle right. of the season, some shit like that? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes you don't. Sometimes niggas be good in certain systems, systems bro. Systems, yeah. And with Golden State, the game was controlled. Mm -hmm. And when they get the pool, like go off, go off. Now pool, you got like not start. to go out. He don't want to. Nah, like, shit, I'm well, I, I don't think it's not because he want he doesn't want to. I he think can't. it's more so like when defense. <laughs> <laughs> well, he can't. You you absolutely right. He's not even the number one on that team. Who's the number one? And that's what they fucking do. God. <laughs> God. Kuzma, you don't like Kuzma? 
Huh? You don't like Kuzma? I mean, we like him, but he's not a number yeah, one. He man, shouldn't man. be a number one on a All team. them niggas, that's a team full of role players. Yeah, bro, that's, that's a team full yeah. of role players. Now, if you take them niggas and put them on a team, <laughs> now that's who the Lakers need. They need Jordan Poole and Kuzma. <laughs> and Kuzma. No, if you no, had them no niggas real come shit. out the bitch, give them one straight. stand a motherfucking chance. I agree. I agree. Why right. you take niggas like that and go start another team? It's like, yeah. it's like, bro, like how the United States was started. <laughs> you had the 13 colonies. <laughs> then niggas want to go make Montana. For what? Keep Nobody want to go to Montana? <laughs> Idaho. For what? <laughs> Y'all could have did all that shit in Georgia and South Carolina <laughs> and made this shit great. Start <laughs> taking some of these teams out of the NBA. Get Washington the fuck out of here. Uh-huh. Detroit got to go. Detroit. Ooh. Oh, nigga. Munchie. You got to go. <laughs> oh. You and Detroit. Get the business out of there. Uh-huh. Out Some of there. you niggas going to play for the uh, goddamn uh, Lions. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't always got to play basketball. I'm dead. <laughs> See what that nigga uh, Jane Wiseman will do at, at, at tight end. You feel me for real? Make, make your other teams better in your city. Hawks. Some of you niggas going to play for the Braves. Brave straight, bro. Don't mess with them. Right. We can use a couple, couple niggas so, to come out. Yeah, couple a couple niggas, niggas come out there and bunt. <laughs> yeah, <run. laughs> Outfield, they ain't hard with a glove on. Outfield yeah. with a glove on. Boo, bogey. Put bogey ass in outfield. <laughs> Saved. T- I get tired of them screaming that nigga name at them hogs. <laughs> bogey for three. <laughs> Who gonna get coach of the year? Gotta be OKC coach. They gonna get him that. If SGA can't get MVP, come on now. The damn coach can't win. You gotta get rewarded for number he one. He got some on, though. Somebody, somebody. Are these the official finalists? Mm-hmm. What's, the, what's the odds on the coach of the year? I don't think I don't think Chris Finch should get it. Who you got? I like the Orlando coach, uh, Mosley. Uh, Half of that team will hurt all year, too. Who, the Magic? Yeah. Oh, somebody was what down. What the fuck are they doing? Suggs, uh, Suggs was hurt. Suggs was hurt. Folks was hurt. One of them twins or one of the brothers was hurt too. Man, who well, give a fuck? Who hurt that team? Yeah, bro. If I when I look at, <laughs> hey, no. bro, they, hey, it I plays know a factor. Saying. It plays I, a factor. That hey, was man. advocate type shit. Now, uh, right. <laughs> for What's the sake the of argument, uh, coach bro. of the year right now. Got the odds. I got yeah. OKC coach. Chris Finch. Yeah. I don't like that guy, man. Oh, yes. you, you okay. going with your heart, man. He's the favorite. What, what's the odds? Uh, negative 310. Oh, you going with your heart? That ain't shit. You what's go- the next one? Chris Finch, Timberwolves head coach at plus 470. And what's next after that? Orlando Magic, Mosley. Jamal Mosley, plus 650. All right. They going to get it. Yeah. That's a big-ass jump. It is a big jump. That's a huge jump. A big jump. All right. Um, speaking of big jump. Jonte Porter <laughs> has been banned lifetime from the NBA. The nigga was making two mil with his NBA contract, and he made twenty one thousand on his bets. He's a stupid motherfucker. <laughs> That's that garbage bastard of the day. You, boy, you was a garbage basketball. Shit, <laughs> nigga. I don't know. I ain't finna sit here and talk like I'm the best with money. <laughs> I fuck up money in my damn <laughs> self. But nigga, I ain't never fucked up like that. Uh, nigga. That's crazy. And you ain't even betting real money. You bullshit. Was he a, was he a, Did was they he say how long he was betting? Man, for like, well, it, nah, they ain't. Man, you bet more than that, nigga. I mean, Fucking but you got you got to understand shot. though, bro. Like he's not a he he's a bottom tier role player, bro, on a two way contract. So like the amount of money he's making is really not that much, honestly. Um, also, to another thing, banning this guy for life, I don't know. I think it's a little too harsh, and here's why. I'm gonna tell you why, right? Man, before you tell me that, okay, <laughs> nigga, I'm not no two way player for shit, <laughs> and I don't I don't bet it twenty one thousand. <laughs> I don't did that on prize picks. <laughs> well, now nah, they just saying that's the amount he profit. He he bet he he plays bets. Way oh, so more. nigga, you ain't even good. Nah, yeah, that nah, was his profit. You ain't good that that bet. Yeah, he made more win. in the NBA. <laughs> <laughs> but go ahead, man. Nah, I I listen. It, it it was dumb, right? But you also have to you know look at this, right? Like 
number one, I think it's a bit of a contradiction, right? Like you got the NBA that are literally telling you the spread on these games live. You got ESPN reporting the story. They also telling you to use their betting app. Like it's it's a lot of things that go on. How can you expect certain players to not be, you know, really, really tempted? You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. Like I, th I think it's a little weird. There's a lot of guys in the NBA that do gamble. He just happened to get caught. But banning right. him for life, that why you I think that's a little good. too harsh. It was yeah, a lifetime caught. ban because he would check himself out of games because he placed the under on himself and he would lie and say he got hurt. Oh, yeah. So when they found that out, <laughs> how you they, get hey, caught? How the hell you get hey, caught? Hey, I'm going to give you a nickname, JP. <laughs> I don't even know what niggas call you. Boy, you crazy. <laughs> I think that was harsh, man. I feel, I feel bad for bro. I'm going to be honest with you. Crazy. But look, this is why I say it ain't too bad, though, man. For them banning him life time. <laughs> he wasn't going to be in that motherfucker long time. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's like, shit, okay. Cool. Well, I, I think the we NBA knew, too, to prove a point. They were like, okay, let's make an example out this guy. Yeah, we know go, he's man. not going to be Later would have been somebody sure. good. Yeah. Right. That nigga sure. Adam Silver like, bro, what's up? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna suspend you. you a couple games. Right, right. Like, stop, 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 yeah, stop. I'm gonna say yeah. I'm gonna say your cousin did this shit. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> when John Tay, they say who? Adam Simpson say who? John Tay Porter. John Tay Porter, you know uh, Michael Porter. You know? Michael Porter, bro. No, right? not Michael Porter. <laughs> no, John Tay Porter. Oh, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that is ass. We gotta show him we mean business around. <laughs> 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 yeah, man, you know Perfect sacrifice. <laughs> yeah. I'm I was dead. looking for a nigga to make an example out yeah. of. Nah, for real. That all makes sense. Well, I, I thought you were talking about my boy Michael Porter. God and then damn, you see, what? you see the the other brother. You see what happened to Michael Porter, the other brother? So hold up, John Tay Porter is Michael Porter brother? Yes. Yeah. And then his other brother is the I thought y'all were bullshit. No, nah, they brother. Oh, that's his nah. brother. Yeah, nah. It's nigga, your brother out here making all that motherfucking money. 200 M's. Yeah. I know Michael Porter like God. Damn, what they, some Michael Porter they, was the first 200 M's contract in the NBA, I believe. This was like three, four years ago. Yeah. What What is other brother? Just the other day, it? the little brother got in a car wreck and killed the people he hit. What? My, what's, his, what's his little brother's name? Um, I forgot. It's another yeah. Porter. Oh, wow. but he, condolences to the yeah. people that uh, died in that wreck. Going man. through all Dang. that. I'm like, dog. I'm finna take the overhaul with Michael Porter next game. I, I thought I, was, I I'm thinking that was gonna mess him up. Last night he come down, hit that three in the nigga, clutch. You th <laughs> nigga, he got a lot on his mind. <laughs> I, see. I thought I was gonna mess him up. He gotta pay up. for some lawyers, all that shit. He locked nigga. in. He that's locked one of my favorite players to watch. He thinking about his next. That's one of my favorite players to watch. He plays with zero care, meaning that bro. he gonna shoot that bitch when he get it. <laughs> I, like I it, love bro. that. I love his overs, bro. If I lose a bet on Michael Porter, I know it wasn't because he didn't shoot the ball enough. Right. <laughs> I just know he had an off night. Mm -hmm. I like betting props on guys like that who I know is gonna. At least shoot the ball a certain amount of time where I have a chance of winning that play. Right. Like that. You know what I'm saying? Like Michael Porter's one of those guys. Uh Malik, uh, what's his name? Malik Be uh Beasley with Beasley. the Bucks. Uh, the Bucks. He's Bucks. one of those guys too. He's, He's gonna, gonna shoot that, that bitch. bitch. Yeah, like I like Porter. I mean, uh Porter's his goddamn uh, PRA mm -hmm. all over because he he do everything. Yeah. Nike received criticism because Star, is it Aja? Aja, Aja. Will Asia. Wilson? Asia. 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 I always say it wrong. Uh, Asia Wilson, who is a two-time MVP, two-time champion, two-time defensive player of the year, finals MVP, five-time All-Star, best-selling author, still doesn't have a signature shoot. They said all that in the end. And she fine. Yeah. And yeah, Caitlin Clark ain't played a game. You get her ugly ass a shoe already. And no black is, WNBA players have ever had a signature shoe contract. You know what time it is. You know what that is. <laughs> Color money. You know what time it is, bro. Better open your damn eye. And nah. they wonder why people ain't watching the damn game. Don't what? nobody want to see them white girls in them ugly ass <laughs> shoes. Well, I I'll say this: people gonna start watching a little bit more now. Oh yeah, one hundred percent. Let's 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 be for real. Like Angel Reese gonna get a shoe watch. Yeah, Angel Reese. Yeah, I think this the sure. time. I think these are the pe the people. It might who not be Nike watching. though. Like, we've been watching these girls for a while now. And the game is way better. So now, it's to me, Nike was like, this is an opportunity. Like, they seen how Steph came in. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? What happened with Steph? So they like, copycat league. She going to be one of ours. You know what I'm saying? So One of them things is just bad timing. Bad timing, bro. Yeah.
Well, I think this is going to be an opportunity that the WNBA used to capitalize on the market growth Damn of their, right. uh, their league with uh, Caitlin Clark because they never had a player with this much hype Buzz coming already. into the league, right? Like, I mean, you have whole states or like all those states you named that people like Oregon, Arkansas, like those places, like, you know, well, they're going to be tapped watch. in, you know, because they want to see Caitlin Clark. Mm -hmm. So And the haters. I'm going to tap in. <laughs> I'm going to watch too. Man. Yeah. If a WNBA player wanted to fly you out, who would it be? Who you would you want it to be? <laughs> Y'all stupid. Gross. <laughs> I don't know them all by heart, but what's the one that used to, she was real pretty and played for Notre Dame. Uh, yeah. That's, is that Sky? Is that Diggins? What's her, what was her name? Skylar Diggins. Skylar Diggins. Yeah. Skylar Diggins. That's everybody. That's, that's the only one. Yeah. I'll go with it. That's the only one. Asia Wilson for real. Angel Reese. Angel Reese? Yeah, Angel bro. Reese. She tall, bro. She. She could probably be done Jack. She's too much. I'm not that tree down, boy. Don't you get in there talking crazy. <laughs> <to say, laughs> why you coming in here to holler late? Angel Reese, bro. She fired. Like, Damn, she probably she want Caitlin Clark. Ew. <laughs> Man, watch out. <laughs> I go to I go I go to South Carolina. I like I like them big, man. I'm going to South Carolina. What's that, Caruso? Cardoso. 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 Yeah. Cardoso. Cardoso. Nigga, fan to be like, play me for your heart. I like Lexi Brown. Who? Lexi Brown. Well, who she play? She be on uh, LA. LA. She be on Gill shit. LA Sparks. Mm-hmm. Yeah. She cute. Who you got, Greg? That's Scarlett an easy one. Skylar Diggins fired up. NFL draft is this Thursday, April 25th. Who y'all got going first? I see, come on, man. What type of question is that? Who you got, Caleb? You know who's going first. Yeah. Like, that's a guarantee. That's like a guarantee lock of the century right there. Like, Caleb Williams going to go number one. I think more so, like, I'm, I'm, it's going to be interesting to see who the patrons draft. Right? They got the, what's the, uh, Michael Penix? Right, they he's set to go number twelve to the Patriots, but I think he's gonna get selected a little earlier than twelve. I don't know. I think he's gonna be that sleeper guy that get drafted a little, you know, earlier than expected. Uh, Bro, Michael why Penix. they got so much uh, hype on JJ McCart? Man. Yeah, I'm not. I'm, they That's got him going before uh, Michael Penix, and I I thought that was crazy. Yeah, that white boy ain't shit. I ain't gonna lie to you. I, I turn. I gotta turn that shit off when that come up. When McCarthy come up, talking about a top five pick. And they'll even say this shit during the seg certain segments. Are you talking about the mock draft? Yeah. Uh, the mock draft? They'll say he doesn't have top five tape, but he might go here. top five. Like, what the fuck what type of sense do they make? Yeah, it's yeah. crazy. I've heard that, so I kind of... What's the what's the guy from uh, Carolina, uh, Drake May? Mm-hmm. Where, where, they have him going like top five. He ain't shit either. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, what? Yeah, he's, he's top three, because Caleb Williams, yeah. his odds is negative 20,000. <laughs> Jaden Daniel is plus 7,500, and Drake May is 95. Jaden Daniels going to be good. Jaden yeah. Daniels. You Bro. like him at number two, though? Who? Jaden Daniels? Shit. Who, 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 who Jaden Daniels is one of the best quarterbacks coming out. Yeah. Yeah. I like him you you like, like him over Michael Penix? Yes, I uh, think Michael. Yes, Penn, I do. I think Michael yes, Penn is going to be a better pro than uh Jaden Daniels. Yeah, I like Jaden Daniels Jayden. better. Better. He's got he a better, better pro. Talent wise, he's better. <laughs> that nigga. He talent wise, he's better. Years. Phoenix is cool. <laughs> you talking about his, Phoenix? But I, 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 I look at, I look at uh Daniel like his shot, bro. Dude, weigh like a hundred. He gonna pounds. get bigger? He, he no, bro. That type of frame, bro, is hard to get bigger, bro. It's hard. And stay fast and elusive. Stay fast. It's hard, bro. You have to factor that in, bro. Like That's Marcel that. with him. Marcel would have paused all that shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nah, I, man. I'm freaking reporter not here. <laughs> <laughs> he took the day off. Nah, they, I think this draft is going to be pretty cool um, for the NFL. I think it's going to be a lot of uh, guys that well, come out see. who are going to be, you know, pro bullish. All right. They say Falcons and the Eagles going to receive punishment for Tampa. Who gives a fuck? <laughs> Don't mean shit. We got some comments. Then we'll do our prize pick segment. Ah, <sighs> let's see. <laughs> the most elusive interview known to man. Shout out to Broken Play. They talking about the uh, oh Kwame, Kwame Brown. Brown. Shout out Kwame Brown. We finally Hell put yeah. that shit out. Motherfuckers been asking for the interview. I don't know why the fuck we were holding it so long, but we put it out. Everybody fuck with it. They fucking with it. Yeah. Had it in the chamber. Yeah. yeah, had it in the chamber. About three months. 
<laughs> like, we don't need the fucking publicity. <laughs> 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 nigga, tell me, nah, nah, just wait for what, nigga? For what? <laughs> shit up. And I want it now. Uh, see, Florida Boy Four said, thought they were going to keep this episode like the Detox album. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, it's a lot of Kwame Brown, man. Shout out to Kwame Brown, man. Pushing up on us. Now nah, that boy a real one, for oh, real. For sure. He he speak his mind like he. I like that. He, Nigga, he, he's I a never real knew one. he would like that. Too. Yeah, Kwame Brown a real one. Off. Yeah, <laughs> that nigga Kwame. Kwame, hey. <laughs> hold on, hold on. He Nothing. want all the smoke. No. Hey, I seen the shit with him uh, going at uh, Gilbert Arenas. Uh, I seen a little video on TikTok, like with the back and forth, bro. That shit had me so. And bad. you know when you, bro, it's easy. That's why I gotta be careful what I say sometimes too, bro. You be seeing these niggas, you call them garbage and all this shit. <laughs> and you look, that nigga Kwame Brown, yeah, yeah. seven two. <laughs> nigga, a motherfucking machine, Damn, like yeah, even bro. even for a nigga like Gilbert Arenas, yeah. Nigga, you keep talking you keep shit to that talk, nigga. Yeah. You can't control when them them big, strong, <laughs> athletic niggas get mad. They and Kwame Brown is my nigga, and he seemed like he's smart. But the nigga fresh out of high school. <laughs> yeah. He knew he was going number one, yeah. so I put him at a 10th grade education. Re no diss, <laughs> man. No, like, like, no. I'm, I feel you, bro. You see what I'm trying to say? You but I'm trying shit. to say is like, you can't mind control a nigga who stopped listening to teachers at 10th grade. Gilbert Arena, you keep talking shit. Keep talking, nigga, yeah. Keep on your ass. Yeah, it ain't no stop. Oh, no look. Stop, yeah. No, no, no. That was for the public. No, bitch. Nah, I ain't no publicity. Ain't no... <laughs> Fight Thanks. now. No, I don't think you'll want to run into Kwame. Yeah. Uh, I don't, yeah. Right. That, that. Shout out to Kwame. You know what's up, nigga. I ain't no bitch <laughs> for a show, but nigga. We on the same team. <laughs> that nigga Ray said, Giannis' brother is the damn definition of it's not what you know, but who you know. <laughs> hey, so they came out. He did negotiate that contract for his brother. Yeah. His brother got a new contract? No, his initial his contract. His initial contract. With the Bucks. What's his contract? My brother got he got his brother. His, his, he he got to like, be suited up. I'm not signing here again unless y'all sign my brother. Dead yeah. ass. He turned down. Yeah. A, a, he, he turned down an Adidas deal because they wouldn't put out the contract the same time he put his brother contract on the table. Mm -hmm. You a real nigga, bro. Giannis, hey, clap it up for Giannis. Giannis a hey. real nigga. Can't be mad. Giannis at this shit, has man. won. The Keep It Nigga Award. <laughs> Can't be mad at that. But hey, March, February, and January. <laughs> nigga, Dude, I don't man. know what kind of negotiation you can make. Now you be like. Got no choice. Even state form. It might have been Adidas. It might have been Adidas. I don't know if it was Nike. But... No, he with Nike now. Shit, it no, might have been Adidas he walked away from. He, 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 he walked Nike. away from the mother, nigga. Yeah. yeah. Cause they wouldn't do it. Exactly. They, exactly. Do it. they said we'll get your brother a week later. He yeah, said, no, no, no. He no. rejected a deal with Adidas for Nike. There you go. Yeah, yeah. he ain't finna cap him down. Like, Do we gotta put the nigga in the commercial? <laughs> <laughs> no, you put my brother with his highlights. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have none. He got four five. Use AI. Use AI. Use AI. Use AI. It's crazy. <laughs> Use AI. It's crazy. <laughs> Use AI. Use AI. It's crazy. <laughs> D Nice said, Nav, you got to enforce a dress code. Lou got Reggie getting his shorts from Children's Place. Oh, that's now. fucked up. That's fucked up. My Man, shorts ain't long enough. Y'all right. niggas wore the short brothers one day, bro. Nah, nah, nah this shit long, man. Nah, this yeah, shit straight. Shit straight. This straight today. It went Lou here. Y'all, it like y'all niggas hype them up. Went, <laughs> them bitches can get the fall and niggas yeah. get the fall and we grab it. This is my nigga, last episode wearing motherfucking shorts. Him, him, and, shorts him and Lou try to outdie each other. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. Nah. Jermaine Riley said, y'all should invite two to three fans to the next live and let them experience the vibes. For sure, we might do that. Oh, man, the next time we have a live, you got to push up. Bro. Back, pull up. Yeah, bro, we had some bad women, some goddamn 1942. Vibe for real. Yeah, some vibes. Had a little I'm DJ. I'm down. I'm down. Playing some 1998 music. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, to get that nigga off the ox. Man, bad women, man. Bad women everywhere. I'm telling you, it was ten women 
and ten of them were fine. Mm-hmm. This nigga put on some game. What song was that? Uh, this that? is uh, no, uh, go no, that game. He's go go ahead. Go ahead. That, that shit. Right. Right. Yeah. I said, man, you don't cut that shit off and play some sexy rap. Some sexy rap, right. Some sexy rap, bro. You know, bro, that's you know what, the, that's what the women you know? like to hear, bro. Yeah. That was so funny. Boy, boy tripping. Robert Keyshawn Turner. Nigga, niggas. He, abri- ab- abbreviate that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Bull got his full name. God damn, nigga, you trying to get your ass scammed on this shit. Yeah. That nigga said, y'all pushing the shows out. We love it. Shout out to Good Eye Media and shout out to Lou for linking with real niggas. Y'all multi millions on the way. Watch and speaking. what's up? Appreciate I talked you, all that shit. You said some real shit. My yeah, bad, yeah. Robert Keyshawn Turner. <laughs> That's like, you know where it's from. <laughs> what, what? Joe Nervous Jr. <laughs> Y'all niggas. <laughs> Y'all gotta watch rugby at some thing. Man. Carl Walker. Y'all need to live stream all the UGA football games, Dog Nation. We might, we might stream some. I'm gonna read two. your comment, Joe Nervous Jr. Y'all gotta watch rugby at some point. Coming from a black rugby player out of Houston is really a slept nose. Damn. Nigga, we wanna bring you on the show. See, I'm glad I came back and read the comment. Nigga, it's a black rugby player. Nigga, send us your jersey. Facts. That's how we know if you really a rugby player. <laughs> send your motherfucking yeah, jersey. jersey. Or you just playing, nigga. You tagging on all the highlights now, boy. Y'all done fucked up. Watch. <laughs> oh, watch. Every single watch. highlight. It's a good comment. JL. Hey, Nav, you got to watch that. He getting too big for the show. Just saw him on Country Wayne skits. He Hollywood now. LOL. You on Country Wayne skit? Yeah, I did. Clap it over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Damn, say fuck this little petty shit. I ain't say that. No, no. Broke your play. Broke your play. Yeah. Yeah, he say he want to be around a real camera crew. All that shit. Shout out to Country Wayne, man. Yeah, yeah. Country Wayne. How was it? Nah, it was cool, man. They just hit me up, asked me if I wanted to be in some skits. Um, I'm shooting another one with them tomorrow, so hopefully they keep, it, keep calling me back. Good shit, there. Appreciate it. So how 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 like was the experience? Man, it's just Jamal like... Strong, ninety seven thirty six. Oh my god! Love the show, but when you get another guest, now Reggie Ball and Lou Young ain't special guests uh. anymore. Yep. We got Manny back. Man. Shout out to Manny. Hell yeah, yeah man. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Reggie and Lou, it's like internal episodes now. Yeah. Internal episodes. Right. It's just family. We doing that. Yeah, they co-hosts. Yeah. Yeah, they do. We got to find a nigga to, to bad finna be busy. Nah, man. <laughs> oh, you going to still have time for some shit? Yeah. Oh, okay. Ain't glow up there. Hey, no. <laughs> Hey, anybody else got any special surprises? <laughs> so look, what Dom and Lou at? Yeah, they working on a project in Detroit. Oh, clap it up for these <laughs> niggas. Everybody moving up help me. Yeah. <laughs> on the way now. That shit oh, on the way. God. Man, fuck this shit. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I don't know if I want to read shit else. <laughs> <sighs> Nav just walked off again. Jaden left that comment. That's how we keep it, nigga. Yes, Frederick Field said, I just love how nigga y'all keep it. <laughs> Jason comments 8906 said, some keep it nigga shirts it is hard. We might get us some. We got to find a way to like put it on that though. I told, you know? I told you, K-I-N, Ken folk, man. Keep it nigga. Yeah, but I... We got to use asterisks. Yeah, you know? or something. Because I don't want to put keep it nigga. Yeah. And we got a lot of white fans. Yeah. I don't want them we to get there and choke down. They don't know that they support, they support the call. Them nigga walk around with a keep it nigga. <laughs> now, yo, we just ain't going to, we ain't going to do that. You setting you set them boys up. Yeah. We want them to support us, but we'll just keep, y'all just buy broken place shirts. <laughs> you have to send a picture of your license to get a keep it nigga shirt. <laughs> I'm dead. 
And nobody can buy it for you. Oh, shit. Nah, we just talking shit, man. Let's go uh, get into the prize picks. Bet. What we doing? NBA? Playoffs. We ain't got no choice. Playoffs. Unless y'all want to do baseball, but I think playoffs. we should keep it. Nah, NBA, right? Keep it yeah, NBA. Playoffs, so. man. Shoot. I'm looking at Brandon Ingram under. He's still coming off an injury. They got him at 30 and a half. Points? PRA. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah, we got that boy Manny in here now. Yes, yeah, sir. Uh, man, I'm, if you don't like one of their picks, let them niggas know. Okay, Please, okay. man. But I'm going to tell you who I like. Uh, I like Luca over. Luca's I think Luca either score 40 tonight. He better. Or Dallas, or Dallas win the game. One of those two things going to happen. What's the line on Luca? He's at 33 and a half. It's That's at 33 points. and a half for a reason. Just points, yeah. Wow. I like KD bouncing back. For real. Uh, what, 26, and, 26 a and a half. I honestly like Booker over more than KD. Where you? Um, Booker is at 25. Um, Booker had a bad game one, and I'm pretty sure he's going that he he's gonna have a better game too. Yeah, him and Bill. Um, yeah, Booker had a really bad game one, like a really bad game one. Um, so that's an easy two leg right there that I really like. Uh, Luca over Booker over on points. Um, y'all know I like to do the two legs. I don't like to go too crazy. I, you know, three max, um, just cause it's a lot easier to hit if you ask me. But yeah, Booker over, um, along with a uh, Luca over. I really, I'm really, really messing with that. All right, that'll be our two. No, nah, that gonna be our two leg, and then we're gonna still put it with the six. Yeah, so that's our insurance. Yeah. Lit. Yeah. What you got, that? I'm gonna take Bi's um under for his pra. Okay. So pra. Yep. You got one, doesn't it? Uh, Zubak over. Who? Uh, Zubak. Oh, the center uh, for Yeah, uh, rebound and assist 12. Over. He had a great point. What's Zubak points? Because, I mean, he was feasting uh, uh, Daniel Gafford. What you, what you say? I just did what? rebound and assist. You did his rebound and assist? You mm -hmm. did rebounds and assist? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's it. Yeah. Hello, uh, Dan, you said B.I.? He yeah. played a night, right? Yeah. This shit getting too saturated. Uh, they just they putting them all on Thursdays and stuff like that. The nigga ain't playing to. Hey man, give me Malik Beasley. Malik Beasley, what? More than nine points. Okay. Like that I don't see close. Brandon Ingram uh that for points, rebounds, and assists. Yeah. I think he might be at the bottom. No, nah, yeah, he is. Okay. Gotcha. Greg, you got one? Okay, so you, you stay over. My pick going to be, uh, I'm going to take, shit, I'd be a fool not to. Got to. What? Damian Lillard. Over. Hell yeah, yeah, how many points they got him at? I ain't even look. Yeah. Oh, 23 and a half? Oh, no, that's the, uh, what's the name? His regular one is, uh. Probably 27 and a half. Damian Lillard, they got him at What's 29 really? and a half point. 29? Yep. Mm -hmm. Sheesh. I like it. You'll take it. Yep. Ain't nobody fuck with that Ant-Man. 25, 5. Oh! Ant-Man, 25, 5. How many we at? <coughs> we only at four. Put Ant-Man, 25. 25 oh, shit. He'll get 28. You're only doing the games for today? Today games? Mm -hmm. No, you could, um, we could put another. Do whatever for real. Yeah, for you could put whatever. This, to the, to the this shit ain't gonna come out the Wednesday night. <clears throat> Whenever Nigel wants to. <laughs> I like the under on Paul George. Yeah, oh, I was what? looking at that. 24. Too. You think he going to have a fall off game? I just think Dallas is going to play. They're going to change that. Yeah, they're going to change Somebody else going to be getting um, bucking. Also, too, uh, I, what's his name is going to get more PT for Dallas? Josh Green. Mm. Mm. 
He's a he's a great defender, bro. I don't know. JK, I'm like, why the fuck this nigga wasn't getting PT? You got Kleba in the fucking game. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. All like, of these game ones. It, like, it's weird. I'm like, Kleba, bro? You got Kleba playing 30 minutes? Yeah. And after this first game, everybody's going to be making defensive adjustments. Exactly. Right. Yeah, I like Josh Green. Josh, I think Josh this. Green's going to do a good job guarding uh, PG. Y'all stop putting so much hope on these coaches. Some of these coaches dumb as shit like that. Nah, they are. They are. Like, like a Darvin Ham. <laughs> he, bro. Look, I'm going to say this. I can't even blame Darvin Ham. LeBron, you 40 years old. Nigga, you know when your team need a timeout. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Nigga, you walk up out to that and you call your own damn. <laughs> nigga, you smarter than that goddamn coach. He said he 40 years old. Bro, that's just like, <laughs> come on. I ain't think of that. It's about time. It, bro, we ain't played no professional basketball. And we know Darvin Ham don't know shit. <laughs> LeBron, one of the smartest players to ever touch a basketball. Yep. You know that coach don't know more than you. Nigga, you up 20. They coming back. Out, Who man. called that? Nigga, me. Who? I ain't give you the signal. I know, nigga. Look, you could join if you want to. <laughs> LeBron got to start talking to them players on it. Nigga, matter of fact, y'all ain't even got to walk to the side. Call a timeout and stay on the court and you talk to them <laughs> niggas who you want to talk to. Keep Darvin Ham out your fucking business. Either this nigga leaking that shit to the other team. <laughs> Ain't no fucking way. That's a that's a good take, bro. The nigga is a, a what they call that shit. That nigga's a leak, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, a spy, a spy. That it's nigga not. informant. That's the word I was looking for. That nigga is a motherfucking informant for the Nuggets. I looked it up. The nigga got a house in them. Bad, <laughs> bro. <laughs> Nah, coach dumb as shit. Nah, Darvin Ham is definitely the dumbest. I coach got Gabert on. Oh, uh, we just add one more, I guess. I don't know. Because we got six plus the insurance. Okay, cool. how many? How many so far? We got Nav had over twenty nine for Damian. We taking? Are we taking Ant Man's over twenty five points? Fucking right. We taking Paul George under twenty four points. And then I got mm-hmm. under bi dot net got over Zubac and you had Malik Beasley. So how many more we need? Is that's, that six? That's six. That's six. Are we good? Shit, it's been a good-ass episode. Lit. Shout out to Dom and Lou, man. Y'all keep doing y'all motherfucking yeah, thing yeah. out there in Detroit. Yeah, Those niggas yeah. might be trying out for the Pistons. <laughs> <laughs> let them know what sure. these niggas doing, man. Pistons. Manny, yeah, let, them know, basketball. let them know where they can find you, Manny. Uh, you still? You still yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, you can find me on uh, Instagram, Fort Manny Bets. Um, I just got into the YouTube scene, so you can check out my channel, Fort Manny Bets 1. Um, so, you know, I'm pretty excited, man. But yeah, man, tap in. I have a lot of things going on right now. Um, just drop the mentorship too as well. So tap in with your boy. What many bits? Yes, what, what's, a, what's a game you might, you see yourself in of uh, doing this playoff? You said, I see what? What game you might hit during this playoff? Oh, Celtics, bro. You gonna hit a lot of Celtics games? Yes, bro. Nice. I'm telling you, that future is gonna cash, bro. 150 to win 500,000, bro. Like, now look. Now, Manny, if the Celtics go to the finals, nigga, you gotta you gotta do some vlogging for Bro, us. Bro, court courtside. I'm pay, I'm dropping twenty k on courtside tickets. Who you going with? Somebody. I don't know. Nigga, fuck with your boy. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, oh, damn, nigga, you don't know nobody yet. <laughs> <laughs> I come with you. Listen, <laughs> it's a must, bro. I, I I have to be courtside or watch that five hundred k. And you keep back. saying you. I'm talking about what. <laughs> <laughs> what? What we gonna use? <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I can hold a camera for you. <laughs> Blog, nigga. <laughs> Blog. No, nah, for sure. I can see that. I can see them going to the finals in the East. But I, the Bucks gonna be they they hardest. The Bucks? I don't know, man. When I look at the Bucks, man, um, you know, th- this team been very inconsistent all year. And I don't want to sound like I'm biased, right? It's like, yo, of course you're gonna say that. Cause you but understand if I put a hundred and fifty thousand dollars on a future play, bro, like so I, when, when did I you looked at a lot of things, bro. In February, I got the odds at plus two fifty. Now the odds for Celtics to win it all is plus one thirty five. So it's dropping. Yeah, it's, it's dropping a lot. You right? been to? Oh, okay. So 
there's probably there's an option where I can actually cash out um, if I hit up um, the uh, Caesars. So I, I, I lock no, in the playoffs. Nigga, nigga, no, I'm not. I'm not going to cash oh, yeah, out. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to cash out. No. But uh, yeah, man. Um, I really like the Celtics, Bucks. I know. Bro. So look, tell me this. I'm not feeling the Bucks. So that'll bring you back what? I, uh, well, 150 pay off 500 thousand. So I'm profiting like 350. So tell me this. If they after the Eastern Conference Final, they had like a 375 cash out. You cashing up? Depending on who I think they're gonna play in the finals, no. If they're playing the nut, well, it won't be three seventy five. They're playing the Nuggets. They okay. pro- yeah, but depending on who they're playing, right? Um, but honestly, no, I want to let this shit ride, bro. Yeah, I yeah, might hedge yeah. during the finals. Yeah, just right? I might hedge. Yeah. You know what I mean? Now that that would be safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah like a hedge. A hedge scenario might be: let's say they go to the finals, uh, and they win game one, right? So their odds is probably going to drop to like maybe minus three hundred, minus four hundred. Where the team they're playing, their odds might be like maybe plus three fifty or plus four hundred, right? So I could possibly hedge like another hundred and fifty k on a plus four fifty. So if you wouldn't even give a fuck what happened. Exactly, right. exactly. So just playing a strategic. Yeah, you got to be very strategic with that. Right. His niggas really take this shit serious, and some niggas just gamble. Nah. <laughs> some niggas. Just <laughs> this is what I do for a living, bro. Man, let them know. What <laughs> Tell them, tell them what I can Hey, find. man, listen, man. This is what I do for a living, man. I'm the biggest goat in the game right now. FNB, top two, not number two, man. Hit me up on the gram. You're going to see me popping my shit every single day, man. Like, I literally wake up, eat, sleep this thing every single day. You feel me? So, this is what I do. You want to run it up, tap in with me. And I'm also very transparent, bro. I keep it pee with my clients every single time. So, you're going to know when we lose. You're also going to know when we win. But I guarantee you, I'm going to be popping my shit more than often. So, tap in with your boy, and that's it. Oh, let's get a picture. Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. Get your nigga up.